I'm Christine McCormick. I've been an educator for over 15 years. The most important thing to keep a student engaged is to have that student know that you care about them because without relationship the student really doesn't care about the text or, or the unit that you're studying. They really care about whether you care. I talk to them before and after class. I have a list of their makeup work. Sometimes I have substitute projects if they've been gone for a long amounts of time. I do home visits, I do phone calls, I email their parents or guardians. I follow up with their coaches. I'm, I'm fairly persistent in trying to catch somebody that's falling. People have the misconception that teaching is a seven to two job and you get your summers off, but really you usually work in your classroom until five or six at night and then you have paperwork and courses during the summer. It's a never ending job. Every year is different because every set of students is different. So. It's, it's always evolving to something different. Some years are very traditional in the way I teach and some years are not. It just depends on the set of students that I have. I have a lot of differentiation in my lesson planning because I have kids that often come in in the inner city school setting that read at a third or fourth grade level and then I have kids that are reading on grade level. So you, you have to have a lot of adaptation for everything in between because once you lose their interest, then you lose their attention, and once you lose their attention, then your class is chaos. I try to keep it relevant to what they're interested in. I keep a quick pace going. I make sure that the students actually understand the text, and we have lively discussions in Socratic seminars. A Socratic oh. seminar is when you have a debate about Don't knock yourself a topic. Down. I also make sure that if it's a difficult text, that students have enough background to actually understand it and just not assume that they know something that they don't necessarily know. Every year I see a class across the stage and graduation is, is the proudest moment of that year because I know I was a part of that because I'm typically the senior English teacher. So I'm always, I'm always happy to see my little baby birds fly the nest.